Who Would Win? Rattlesnake vs. Secretary Bird by Jerry Pallotta, illustrated by Rob Bolster. The rattlesnake is hungry and is looking for a bird to eat. What bird should it go after? If it attacks a bird, who would win? Birds of Prey Should the rattlesnake attack an osprey? This ocean bird eats by catching fish with its sharp talons. Ospreys are also called seahawks. A bald eagle? It is a national symbol of the United States of America. You can find it on a $1 bill. A barn owl? It eats mice, voles, shrews, and other small mammals. An owl's feathers are shaped so it can fly quietly. A vulture? Not a pretty bird. It eats carrion. Carrion is the rotten body of a dead animal. Other birds. A peacock? What beautiful tail feathers. This bird is in the pheasant family. A male is a peacock. A female is a peahen. A wild turkey? Sorry, turkey. A sandhill crane? It looks like a dinosaur with feathers. Sandhill cranes squawk so loud you can hear them miles away. A hummingbird? No, too small. A hummingbird egg is the size of an M&M. None of these birds look interesting enough. How about a secretary bird? What a strange name. We'll meet it soon. Meet the rattlesnake. The western diamondback rattlesnake is a venomous snake found in North America. Its scientific name is Crotalus atrox. Its name means fierce rattle. Repeated sheddings of its skin creates a rattle at the end of its tail. When threatened, this snake rattles its tail. Venomous means having a poisonous bite. You can identify different rattlesnakes by the designs on their scales. Do you see the diamond skin pattern? Meet the secretary bird. The secretary bird lives in Africa. Its scientific name is Sagittarius serpentarius. It has an unusual diet. It eats snakes and other animals. Its scientific name comes from two constellations, Sagittarius, which means archer, and Serpentarius, which means serpent handler. Birds don't have arms and hands, they have wings. A constellation is a pattern of stars in the sky that makes a shape. Its head looks like it's surrounded by quill pens. That's how it got the name secretary bird. Length. The western diamondback rattlesnake can grow up to about seven feet long. Here are silhouettes of a basketball player and a rattlesnake. A silhouette is a dark shape against a lighter colored background. A rattlesnake weighs up to 15 pounds. The reticulated python is the longest snake in the world, about 23 feet long. If you hear the rattle, stay away. It's not the biggest or the smallest snake, but it is a deadly venomous snake. Height. For a bird, it's really tall. A secretary bird can grow up to four feet high. That's taller than most kindergartners. The extinct 12 foot tall moa was the largest known bird to have lived on Earth. The tallest living bird is the ostrich. It is nine feet tall. A secretary bird weighs about 12 pounds. Most of its height is in its legs, long, skinny legs. It's a reptile. A reptile is a cold-blooded vertebrate animal that is covered in dry scales or horny plates. Snakes, lizards, crocodilians, and turtles are reptiles. Did you know vertebrate means an animal with a spinal cord? Most reptiles lay eggs. Snakes have scales. The rattlesnake has a forked tongue. Its tongue is multi-talented. It can taste, smell, and tell temperature. 
It's a bird. Birds are warm-blooded, winged vertebrates that are covered in feathers and have scaly legs and a beak. Kiwis, penguins, cockapoos, chickens, ostriches, emus, cassowaries, elephant birds, and rias cannot fly. The secretary bird does not have a special tongue. Birds have beaks, not teeth. Rattlesnake skeleton. This is a rattlesnake skeleton. Ribs, ribs, and more ribs. What does the skeleton remind you of? A. Coiled spring. B. Slinky. C. Dragon. D. All of the above. Humans have 33 vertebrae and 12 sets of ribs. Rattlesnakes have between 200 and 400 vertebrae and ribs. Snakes have teeth called fangs. Secretary bird skeleton. This is the skeleton of a secretary bird. What does it remind you of? Does it look like a dinosaur skeleton? African marching eagle, serpent eagle, and the devil's horse is his nickname. Most birds, including the secretary bird, have knees that bend backwards. Find me. Western diamondback rattlesnakes live mostly in Western North America. Here is where they live. When people have a contest to catch rattlesnakes, it is called a rattlesnake roundup. Look for me. The secretary bird lives in the grassy plains and savannas of Africa. A savanna is a treeless plain. A group of birds is called a flock. What's special? What is special about rattlesnakes? Rattles. The rattle is at the tail end of the snake. Did you know? A rattlesnake is not the type of snake to go looking for trouble. The rattle sound is a warning to stay away. Rattlesnakes molt and shed their skin. The more times they shed, the longer their rattles. What's unique? What is special about secretary birds? They have the longest legs of any bird of prey. Their lower legs are extra skinny. This protects the secretary bird because there is nothing there for a snake to bite. Ornithology is the scientific study of birds. Birds have four toes on each foot. Their toes are as sharp as razor blades. Watch out, they kick, they stomp. They even kick snakes. Delicious. Rattlesnakes prefer to eat small mammals. This rattlesnake is eating a mouse. Rattlesnakes eat rabbits, rats, voles, mice, squirrels, gerbils, prairie dogs, chipmunks, and hamsters. Snakes do not chew their food. They swallow their food whole. Rattlesnakes have no interest in eating humans. People are too big for them. Rattlesnakes eat only what they can swallow whole. They also eat frogs, birds, lizards, and other snakes. The lifespan of a rattlesnake in, in the wild is 14 to 20 years. Yummy. The secretary bird eats snakes and lizards. When they find snakes, they kick them with their razor-sharp claws. Whap, whap, whap. They also attack with their sharp beaks. Here is a secretary bird eating a lizard. It looks delicious. Can you imagine eating a live lizard? Young secretary birds eat insects. The arrangement, color, and shape of a bird's feathers is called its plumage. The lifespan of a secretary bird is between 10 and 15 years. Famous. There is a major league baseball team called the Arizona Diamondbacks. The Florida A&M Rattlers have a great logo on their helmet. Snakes have dry skin. They are not greasy or slimy. A ophiologist is a scientist who studies snakes. Oddball. Secretary bird is a strange name. 
Should it be named the soccer bird because it, of its kicking ability? It is a unique bird. It has a face like an eagle, legs like a stork, and it eats like a bird of prey. The secretary bird is the national symbol of Sudan. It's also on the coat of arms of South Africa. Slow. Rattlesnakes move slowly. They slither up to two or three miles per hour. Rattlesnakes can go underground to hide and be safe. Their home is called a den. A den is the home of a community of snakes. A burrow is the home of one snake. Did you know up to 200 rattlesnakes can live in one den? Run. The secretary bird runs fast. It is considered a terrestrial bird. That means it mostly stays on the ground. It prefers to run. Did you know it can fly, but it takes a while to get off the ground. Sleep high. At night, secretary birds fly high up in acacia trees and safely sleep. Lions, hyenas, and jackals can't get them in a tree. Weapons. Rattlesnakes have fangs and poisonous venom. They bite and they inject the venom through the hollow fangs. Rattlesnake venom is a coagulant. It ruins the lining of your cells. When it attacks, it is lightning fast. A coagulant makes blood more solid. Weapons. The secretary bird has four great weapons. It can fly, run fast, and has a sharp beak and deadly claws. A raptor is a bird that hunts and eats other animals. It can jab with its beak, stomp with its feet, and kick with its long legs. The secretary bird is in an acacia tree, ready to hunt. It's on the lookout. In the wild, it is eat or be eaten. The secretary bird looks down on the ground for food. The rattlesnake is safe and sound in its den. It's getting hungry. It decides to take a peek outside. The rattlesnake sticks its head out of its hole. It's looking for a tasty mouse or a delicious rat to eat. The secretary bird sees the snake, swoops down, and uses its feet to stomp the rattlesnake's head. Ouch, that hurt. The snake wiggles back into its den. Now the secretary bird is on the ground. It can fly, but it can also run fast. It looks around. Where did that snake go? The snake decides to fake out the bird and use its secret second escape tunnel. The bird hears it. As the rattlesnake moves out of the den, the secretary bird uses its foot to stomp on the snake again. Most raptors attack from the air. The secretary bird attacks on the ground. The snake moves into a defensive position to bite the bird. The secretary bird's body is too tall for the snake to reach. The snake tries to sink its fangs into the bird's ankle, but there isn't enough there to bite. The bird dances away. The snake tries to bite again. Yikes, poison. The bird has to be careful. The bird kicks the snake, whap. Then the bird stomps on the snake with its razor sharp claws, whap. The bird kicks the snake again. The snake goes flying in the air. The snake lands on the ground. It decides to skip dinner and escape to its den. As the snake moves back and forth across the ground, the secretary bird keeps on kicking it, whap, whap. Whap. In between kicks, the secretary bird pecks the snake on its head. The rattlesnake is wounded. The bird gives it another kick. Whap. The secretary bird uses its wings to balance itself while stomping on a snake. The secretary bird eats the rattlesnake. The fight is over. What must it be like to eat a wounded venomous snake? Yuck.